All right, Coach, tell me a little bit for, a little bit about just uh, a comeback win. You haven't had a comeback win all year. It seems like you've had these games go against you. Just tell me a little bit about this win and what it means for the team. Yeah, you know what? Our guys fought their tails off. We went against a potential first-rounder tonight, and that guy had his stuff tonight, but we stayed on it. We stayed on it. We got a big blow early. Jeremy Hill was a big hit early and got us going a little bit, and then we got a big blow from, uh, you know, from Mike uh, LaGrange. There was a two-run home run, put us ahead. Gave him a couple runs there at the end, but Seth West was pitching tail off. I just wish we could have got him a win, but uh, all, you know we were relentless with it. We got it done the ninth, made some great plays, and then Austin Flores gets a big one right there at the end. I was proud of him. First time his parents get to see him uh, play at Nichols State University, and I was proud for him to be able to get that done right there. Coach, it's very weird in a game where you have 15 batters strike out, and yet you have six hits, and you still somehow pull out the win. Just tell me how bizarre that is. You don't see that too often. It is. It says a lot about what Seth West did. Um, you know, gave up some singles there, but nothing ever hurt him. And, and you know what? Could I have left him in? It's possible. But with a quick turnaround, I didn't want to do that to him. And I, want, I felt confident and bragged a lot. Jordan McCoy got it done for us right there. But uh, it is. It is very bizarre. And, and, and I tip my hat to their, their guy on the mound. He was good. Our guys seemed to find it, get it done when it was the right time.